Happy Sunday! I wanted to come in today and share with you guys a Target Target Dollar Spot Christmas haul. And yes, it's still hard for me to talk if you guys watched my last video. I said that I have a little three-year-old Danica. I was tying her shoelace. She was underneath me. She went up, got me right at the bottom of my chin, and I bit my tongue so hard that until now it still hurts to talk. Okay. All right, let me start opening things up. I bought these, if you guys noticed. So I have a bag within a bag in here, and then I have this. So these are all the Christmas... Christmas items on the Target dollar spot, but I did have to go through two different Target stores and three, I think it was three different days that I got these. And I didn't just go to them specifically, I just happened to go to Target and I always check out the dollar spot, especially when the new season starts coming out. Because if you guys are Target fans, like my family and I, we just go to Target. Like most of our shoppings are. Trader Joe's, Costco, Target. There are those um, little times that we do go to like Walmart and then grocery store, but really those are our three big stores to shop at. And if um, when the new holidays come in, if you go to Target often enough, you know that once they start coming out with the holiday decor, maybe for fall, Halloween, Christmas, um, New Year, Valentine's Day, Easter, summer um fourth of july those kind of things you gotta get them when you see them because they they go out just like that okay so let's just go with this bag first i've already forgotten what i got although i did purchase these like last sometime last week today sunday so in this bag it's funny because this is the bag i got these these items here in the north seattle target and it's called the North, I think Northgate Target, which is, I think, three levels. One, two, three. Yeah, I think it's three levels. And over there, they charge you for paper bags. So I paid five cents, I think, for that particular paper bag. But this one just had these tiny... Okay, I'm sorry. Oh. Sorry, I dropped one. Um, these tiny little stockings and so I bought so when I saw them I was debating on getting the big ones because they also had the big ones they just brought them out that day so all the letters were there and I've been trying to get new stockings for the kids that has their initials but because we needed so many D's and J's I could never get enough for the whole family but this year I was on top of it okay so Family names are Jacob and Diane for, for, the, for the mom and dad. So this is mine and hubby's. And then comes Jonathan, the oldest. And then Jonathan, Danielle. Oh, no, 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 I'm sorry. This is Java. Java's our dog. So Java's our dog. So Java. And then we had Jonathan, Danielle, Danny <laughs> Danica all right so for the family mom and dad had greens the kids had white and red and then the dog had the green so three dollars each I believe uh, yes and then I just picked that up Friday and today's Sunday so if you're if you haven't visited your target yet so go check them out and they most likely will still have it I bought this gift bag at Target for a dollar. Now, it's so pretty that I don't want to use it as a gift bag. What I'm going to do with it is like cut it where the ends are because I'm all into that red truck. If you guys follow me on Sensi videos, you know that we have a red delivery Sensi warmer that's just like the red truck with the Christmas tree. So I saw this and I'm like, okay, so perfect. So what I'm going to do is cut this out. I'm going to create it just like you see the black and white photos behind me. I have a video here and it's called um, Photo Canvas Tutorial. And it's simple. You just get your photo or um, in this situation, this bag, you cut it. 
Now you can apply this to a canvas, you can apply this to a wood, doesn't matter what you apply it to, it's the same technique. You get Mod Podge, um, layer the Mod Podge board, whatever your board you're going to use, maybe canvas, board, or whatever. Layer with lightly Mod Podge, cut this out, put it on top. Not upside down, not, you just place it on top just like that. And then, and then you let that dry a little bit and then you apply a thin coat of Mod Podge like three times. Um, and then if you wanted to seal it, you can apply um, acrylic spray sealant. Sorry, I was um, coughing. <coughs> okay, so that's the reason I got this. And that was a dollar. And then, ooh, Jonathan. Yeah. Can you bring me the, the mug over there, my Christmas mug? So, um, I got these gift bags. They're two for a dollar, yeah. They're smaller in size, but I think the theme now for Target for their Christmas theme, because they always have a, some sort of a theme. And um, I, just, I just think it's so pretty. I don't even know if I'm going to use it as a gift, but I definitely want to use it for something. I think, I think I'm going to use it just like the, the, the gift bag that I just showed you. But um, cut it. Thank you, bud. And so um, I have to get. We've been using it. So I bought two of them. One for me, one for hubby. They were three dollars, and it's still wet. <laughs> I just washed it. And um, look at the inside of this. It's um, first I was talking about the bag, and then I was talking about this. Okay, well because of the Target gift bag, it's the same theme. So they had three different mugs one was plaid I think it was supposed to be like this design and then one was like just like cream and red with a Christmas wreath I think it was but they're three dollars and I love this mug I always have to get like some sort of a Christmas mug every year but very light very wide and I love the design design is awesome so you got the bicycle with the trees and then the handle matches the the rim but it's a light like um, light colored green and then you go into like the holly berry green and then you got the bike and then inside so um it's just it's almost like that um it's almost like the camping mug it was a little wet inside um, it's almost like the camping stoneware. Is that what it's called? Stoneware? But it's ceramic. But the nice thing is, is that it's very lightweight. Lightweight. So hubby and I have been enjoying it with our coffee and our tea since we got it uh, Friday. I had a little water in there. Okay, I'm going to go ahead and put that away before I ruin other stuff because it got a little bit of my bag wet, but I was able to dry it. So for $2, I got two bags. Oh, this one is for Danielle's halal. Just place that in there. Okay, my receipt. The nice thing also about shopping at Target is that you don't need your receipt, only if you're paying cash. But with a the card, then they can um, easily find it. So look what I got for the girls or the kids. Um, I say the girls because the little ones and you know the big ones they still believe. The little ones believe in Santa, but the big ones like no. But um. Every year, as a part of our Christmas tradition, we always write a letter to Santa and we go to Macy's because Macy's has that big red box that says mailing to Santa. And then it comes with a, um, like a poster, like a postcard. And then they write out their wish list there. We take a picture and somehow Santa knows what they got. But um, this one was $10 over at Target. Um, this is not part of the dollar spot. This was in their Christmas decor. So I picked it up. It has this little, um, like handle to pull. That's where you put your letters. I just think it's adorable. North Pole and then it has the postmark, Santa on the side. You could even do it to where if you're a handy dandy craftswoman or craftsman, you can have a little post and then um, put uh, 
nail nail it or not nail it glue e6000 glue it and then it can stand like that so then it can have its own stand which maybe I want to do um, for the family and then I'll have the boys do it for me um, but I like it and then it comes with a just like a mailbox not cute okay ten dollars really scored on that one so that's that's it for that bag oh and this was also in that bag but um okay <laughs> all right friends the battery died and I was just wrapping it up with a oh with the box and then I was showing you the slippers this is not part of the dollar spot it was part of like the holiday pajamas for kids collection and this is a wonder shop at Target slippers and I believe it's seven dollars and the nice thing is it was for Danica I don't know if it shows yep shake to light up you see how I don't know if the camera is picking that up yeah the nose lights up okay so I got that um, it comes in different sizes and it also comes I think in um, elf an elf okay that was seven and then I got a couple of these I got two of these and these are the Christmas sacks these were so popular last year and this is huge for three dollars so see how huge um, comes with uh, it's burlap Merry Christmas with Christmas and candy canes and then a tie and then you basically put all the the gifts in here so it's great when we um when we go to families maybe I can use it for that for that or also um, as like a sack to put um, by your Christmas tree if you have kids and say it's um, Santa Santa <laughs> dropped it off and and stuff so I got two of those and then dollar spot I have two dish towels for three dollars one is just a stripe the other one has the love peace believe cheers so cute and then this was just another target um, like two days before that one look okay so while I was charging I put water and lemon I have I have lemon my hands are clean but I because it's so cold it's 37 degrees today it snowed did I say it snowed yes it snowed it snowed all day this morning and yesterday and our home is freezing freezing cold and so that's why that slipper is gonna really go well for Danica but I can't drink water now like regular tap water or regular filtered water from the fridge I have to warm it up and then I like to put lemon okay so like I was saying the theme seems to be this bicycle yeah. but look I found it on a little pillow that is I think three five dollars I think it's so adorable it's just a little rectangle pillow I'm gonna put it right here on my chase uh, my um, studio so it's gonna go perfect in there I like I wanted a pillow in there anyways but I, I had one in there but it was too bulky that one is just a perfect little size for it so pretty excited about that and then garland so this is a nice garland it doesn't look too cheapy like some other garlands and you can't beat it for the three dollars so it's pretty long and what I'm gonna use this for is I have a couple customers that bought for me before a wood sign and let me let me let me take it out so alright so I'm in the process of making this wood sign for me you guys can see how big it is see how big so I make wood signs this one is almost as tall as I am but over here I'm going to put happiness and then is and then home with the big home and then made with a little maid so happiness is homemade so I wanted to get those garland be able to put it around my big O in the home 
So then I can change it. Um, I can change out the garland for like Christmas time. I can use that, and then for throughout the year, I can just use a regular green garland boxwood like the one I have. Um, like the one I have on my front door. If you guys watch my my vlog, so that's the reason why I bought this. Was for um client orders because it's pretty long and then I can I can cut it to size of whatever size I want and then we twist it so I got two of that I should have gotten one more I didn't want to be too greedy but I should have because they're only three dollars okay and then even though I make signs I couldn't pass this up for three bucks so I can make signs like this. I actually have another sign downstairs. I just, I still have to paint it. But this is one of the signs I'm going to make, which is fresh cut uh, farm tree. Um, it says, what did it say? Fresh cut. It's one of those fixer upper uh, Joanna Gain sign. And then um, it says haul yourself. I, I think that's what my sign was going to be. But... Christmas tree farm. I forgot what it was. I have the saying, but I, I, I bought the file. I just don't... I bought the file. I just don't remember what the saying was. But it's basically going to be like this. White background, red with the Christmas trees, and then lettering. So that's going to be my next sign. But I couldn't pass this up for three bucks. How cute. And that's it, friends. Um, that's all. That's, that's all my Target... Target Christmas haul to show you guys. I think I got some awesome deals. I am so happy I got stockings enough for the family. And hubby and I are really enjoying this mug. $3. Um, grab it. They still had a lot in my Target. But I hope you guys enjoyed this Christmas haul videos from Target. As always, thank you guys for visiting us here at A Simply Simple Life. With our Scentsy hauls, our vlog, our recipes, our DIY and our shopping hauls. Mahalo guys and have a great amazing week ahead.